This video shows how to perform a firmware update on the Zero Coast using a bootloader audio file. Start by turning off your Wi-Fi connection so you can be sure that no unwanted sound will be output by your computer. I have downloaded the zip file and I am extracting its contents now. Here is the WAV file. Open it in a player of your choice. I prefer QuickTime because it is very simple. Turn the output volume all the way up. On the zero coast, we will patch from voltage math to tempo input and turn the attenuverter all the way up to generate a positive voltage. While powering up, I hold program B. We can see the program B, MIDI A, and MIDI B activity windows are lit to show it has powered up in bootload mode. Now we will remove the patch cable and press program A to get it ready to load. Patch from the computer's audio output to the tempo input. Press program B one more time. This erases the Zero Coast firmware. We can still boot it up, but only in bootload mode until the bootload procedure is finished. Both program buttons and MIDI activity windows light up to indicate it's ready for the WAV file. Now we will press play on the computer and watch program A and program B alternate to show that the bootload procedure is underway and the Zero Coast is receiving data. When the sound file has ended, the Zero Coast returns to normal operation with the new firmware.